Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, look at that one. That's a nice car right there. I like that blue color. Oh, what is that? Pretty sure someone knows the color of that car over there. Go to the best restaurant. All right. We got an Ashton Martin here, not too bad. We got the Maybach, Jesus. La Jolla does not play. Yo, if Sheba goes up to a million, I'll get me a Maybach. <laughs> yeah, I think we're over there on the other side. We have the uh, Bugatti on the other side. So we're over here at the uh, Algera Dogs and Cars event. Special sponsor. What's up, Pooch? Oh, you're gonna give me a couple. Okay. Let's start with Custom Sky P12. That's P10, Jesus. I like it. I like it a lot. With the fixings. Did you drive one of these cars? It's kind of low, you said? Uh, no, I was thinking there. No, I said you like the low cars. Yeah, I might buy this one. I like it. I like the color. I like the tire side. That's flat. It's a 355. Oh, it's too dark. Can't see anything. Awesome. I know, look at that. He's so handsome. These are nice cars you got here. Do you have a, you have a card or is that a... All look at it, CBD. Pinta.com is going to be my website, but let me give you my QR code. Oh, look at this guy. Let me hold my info in as well as a sign. Okay. I'll take some. This is a, I want to say this is a Bentley GT Continental. I think it's the same one in the back, but wow, look at you. For sale here too. I like this one. I can see myself driving this. Yeah, you know how much this one costs? It's not that expensive actually. I thought it would be, but it's like probably like a hundred thousand. No, nah, it's probably around three hundred thousand. A hundred, three hundred thousand. Wait, are these the same? Yeah, they're the same car. Oh. It looks so well, much wider in the back and then like narrow. Yeah. Got those wide tires, 315s. That's not bad. They come with the uh, little license plates that are like uh, okay. license, not license, but they're like digital. So you can use your phone to change it. This car is a lot wider in person. It seems like someone just bought it already, I guess. It's got a giant Yeah. Does this one have a bow in it? Oh, yeah, no, they're both for sale, I guess. 
Enjoy your night now. That's not bad at all. <laughs> not for these people. I was going to say, indoors open as well? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Feel free to look through. Well, thank you. So fun Jeez, man. Doing non stops, no stops. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I think I heard someone say they had a shoe around here. A shoe around here. A shoe around here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. That was close, I'm gonna the glass. Oh yeah. This is my new, this is my new car right here. Let's see a quick return to the code to the moon. I'm over here looking at cars like, I like the chairs. <laughs> yeah, they're very stylish. Hey, the red calipers? That's nice. Hey guys, I saw him posted. There's one sold right Ma'am, sorry about you. What kind of dog is this here? Oh, it's a, it's a lilac French and she's rare. She's got green eyes. Yeah, look at your eyes. You're so cute. Yeah, she's a lilac French. Is it okay if I pet her? Oh, sure. Oh, sorry. I kind of want to be weird. Oh, sure. Uh -huh. And this is Mocha. Mocha, nice uh, to meet you, bud. Oh, you're so excited. <laughs> she's just only, she's just turned nine months. She's gonna be three, so. <laughs> you're so cute. She's like, you, can't, you have to pay attention to me, too. <laughs> right. I'm the, I'm the sh star of the show here. <laughs> so what do you think about... O'Gara? And then do you like, oh. do, do you YouTube also, or do you just GoPro? Uh, I'm a new YouTuber. A lot of my content is actually just like... Good for you. Money, right? You're stepping out of the box. Do you listen <laughs> to Gary V? Uh, I love Gary V. All right, uh, that's yeah. the man. Exactly. I'm telling you. He knows stuff way <laughs> ahead of time for everybody else. Literally, that's, that's kind of what I hate to say, too. Like, I was listening to his podcast actually this morning, and the idea, the, idea, like, the idea that he thinks that he's ahead of the time because of what happened in the past, I love that because it's like... Not a lot of people. He was talking about NFTs three and a half years ago. Exactly. So I'm exactly. telling you, if you want to know like what's going to happen in the future, you just listen to him. Exactly. So that's pretty much what I'm doing. Now it's kind of like, I don't know. But good for you. You're stepping out of the box. I, like I would videos. do it. I'm I like 56, and I'm like, eh, I don't know. I don't think I'm photographable enough. No, there's another guy know. named uh, Danny Koshman who I watch too, and he's like a, a commercial real estate and whatnot. What sort of your niche? Uh, my your... niche right now is just automotive. A lot okay, of automotive so just... and sports, right? Okay. So I'm kind of just doing like that kind of thing where I just take videos of cars where they're at. I don't, to a, I don't go to a lot of dealerships, but I've been to a few dealerships. And how do you feel about the metaverse and NFT? I, I love cryptocurrency a lot. Like, it's all right. my thing. I'm, it's, I'm all in. Yeah, I'm all it's in. But I mean, I'm like, you know, I didn't grow up with computers, so I mean, it, it was like a big leap exactly, of faith. Exactly, right? But I mean, I knew I was going to be left in the dust if I didn't keep up with the language. Exactly, 100%, 100%. Like, my biggest thing, too, is like talking to my mom, too, and my friends. Who, like, I'm in the military. Do you have well. a Robinhood account? I have Robinhood, I have Fidelity, I have... Coinbase, Coinbase. I, have, I, like, I even mine my stuff too. I have my own crypto miner and whatnot. I do too. I have CleanSpark. Oh, nice. Clean nice. Spark. That's a good one. That's uh -huh. a good one. Like my big, oh, oh my look God. at you. <laughs> yeah, oh. oh my gosh. Oh, yeah. It was nice talking to you guys. I love oh, you guys. Hey, it was a pleasure. What's your, what's your YouTube uh, channel? My YouTube is I am Fuzi. So it's F double O Z Y. All right. Yeah. All right. But you I'll, certainly I'll have like. Sure, I like your channel. I appreciate it. Thank I mean, you. you know, Really awesome, you know, kudos for you stepping out of the box. Trying my best here, thank right. you. Big deal. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you black dog? Sorry to bother you guys. Do you guys know anyone that works here? I work here, yeah. Okay. yeah. And that was the funny question. I can only take a guess how much that car costs, yeah. but how much does it really cost for a gear, or to sell out of gear? What's what's uh, what's your guess? So that's the Bugatti Chiron? Yeah. Wait, what year is it? It's a 19 Sport. Okay. Yeah. Well, like a 19 Sport is probably, like, I know that MSRP was like around 1.5, but it's probably like 3.5, 3.6. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty close. It's 3.35, but yeah. the original MSRP was uh, 3.6. Oh, really? Oh, for the Sport. Is that for the Sport or for all Chirons? Uh, the base price for the Sports are 3.15. Okay. I'm like, do you know... I know everyone talks about it, but like when it comes down to financing, this, how do people finance it? Do you have like a big bank, or is it like you know, like Bank of America, Wells Fargo, or like kind of like typically with people, the buyers who are buying stuff like that, they, 
if somebody is buying a car like that, they don't. They don't Finance. Buy that. Oh, of course. And then okay, now. But a car like stuff like this, we work with Lamborghini Financial. Oh, Lamborghini Financial. Okay. Mm-hmm. Now my thing is too is like I'm not saying like I'm cheating. Let's go. If something happened, I'm gonna do a little lot, lot of ticket. I always have to plan ahead, right? Mm-hmm. Now the thing is too, if I were to bring, if I were to buy this car, would I do cash? Would you do credit? Would you be like, well, what exactly would you want to do? Right? Do you guys accept cryptocurrency? Do you guys accept throw over? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we do Yeah, we do accept crypto. Okay. Now. So say, say for instance, I do a debit card. I mean, I don't think a debit card is ever. Do people do debit cards? Do you like that? No. no. So how would someone do a transaction other than cryptocurrency? Is it like a wire transfer or like a check or? It's typically wires, yeah. Okay. Typically a wire no, transfer. And I just fill out a form and have to go from my bank account to your bank account? Or when I can get an escrow where I have to call a third party company? And no, like, you just contact your bank and... Really? How do you do? Like something like PayPal, like, oh, PayPal. Right? The reason why I'm saying this is because like even right now too, I'm like in the process of trying to get myself a house, right? It's like super fucking complicated. Buying a house is yeah, when buying I, a house. Is when I bought my first car, or it's like I'm finding something like that. When I got my first car, it was super simple. Like how much do you want to pay? Oh, I'll do this one. Okay, cool. We'll give you a loan for that much, you know. And it was super simple. I'll go to the bank or go to the dealership for our farm, and they call my bank and they give me the money. <laughs> like but the house is making me nervous because I'm like, if I want to step up even more, I'm like. Like this, which I really do. Like. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you could finance something yeah. like this. I mean, I probably won't. I mean, you're right. I probably won't. Uh, but like from what we've seen, you know, people who buy cars like like high dollar cars like that. Right. Now, if what, someone's in the position to even think about buying that car, they'll make they it. Okay, okay. Now, what would, now, do you guys have like a cryptocurrency in mind that you're willing to trade with? Or is it kind of no, well, we use BitPay. BitPay, okay. So we use BitPay and then yeah, I think they we transfer it to the BitPay okay. and then we'll, we turn it into uh, like cash, cash right okay. away. Okay. And then once we have the cash, we release it. But we use BitPay. Well, I really do appreciate you guys being like, what do you say, uh, uh, moving forward, you know? Because a lot of people are like, no, I won't take cash. I won't do this anymore. Right? Yeah. Yeah. All right, well, I'll keep you guys. Cash is king, man. It is, always. Yeah, of course. That's why, I, yeah, of course. All right, I appreciate the time. Yeah, no worries at all. Yeah. All right, so I think we saw this one before. Yeah. 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 Oh, that car out there though, I like that a lot. I think that's the Phantom, or I'm not sure what that is. I'm not gonna guess, but anyways, that's a nice car out there. Yeah. What do you think about like this one? Yeah. That's a reason, that's a reason. Gonna go over here to the, uh. Okay. <laughs> We got exotics in that place. I guess there's a luxury market over here. We got Rolls Royce and Bentleys. You like Bentleys? I'm so glad I said that because I like Bentleys too. Yeah, Bentleys are my favorite. If I were to get the luxury car, I'd probably get this one. I was thinking about getting a Bentley, or not thinking about, but if I were to get a car, I'd be like Bentley Continental GT. I think this is, yeah, this is the one here. So this is a Bentley 2022. Jesus. Yeah, the Bentley Continental GT. Oh, that one over there looks nice too. You can tell the Bentleys, because Bentleys have the circular lights and whatnot. And then the Rolls Royce. That's also a Bentley too. That's nice. And then the Rolls Royce is over here. Or Bentleys. Also, I like the Bentleys too, because they have that, that crystal light too. Like when that turns on, it looks like crystal. Well, Bentley is a luxury, a luxury car brand. So when you think of luxury, you think of soft and super nice and like the most expensive parts and like really well like designed I like kind of cars. That. This is the luxury Grand Spear or luxury Grand Spur. No, I'm sorry. It's a GT, luxury GT. Yeah, they're old. I'm not really into like old motorcycles. I like new motorcycles. This is kind of nice. I'm glad that I was able to talk to that lady because, like, oh, that dog has a sweater. <laughs> the best time to live for a Shout out to Aguero of San Diego for hosting us. Very good place. Not gonna lie, it's pretty nice, very informational. Okay, this Ducati is actually pretty nice. Jesus. 
Oh wait, what did that say? Not for sale, on display purposes only. What do you mean? Okay. That was nice. I like that black one. This one's also nice too. Now the orange one is a McLaren. Uh, it says over there it's a 720. That's one of the faster ones. Uh, it's a like super nice car. I want to get the. Not say I want to get, but I would get the McLaren 720. I would get it in all black probably. They also have like a newer one. Or oh, actually, this is the newer one. Yeah, it looks like someone owned it already, so it's someone's car here. Yeah, 7 2019. Oh, that's for sure, I guess. I was always seeing this like someone owns it. I like this color too, but I like the color on it. I really like this color. You want to go check out the, uh, let's go check out the Porsches again. Or the Porsches. This is a nice spot. Like, if I had a dealership, it would be like this. Yeah, it's a nice dealership. Oh, look at that. They got a walkway up there. Oh, that's pretty tight. Yeah. Woo, it's bright. I got more clips outside. Yeah. Was this here earlier? I don't know if this here earlier. Yeah, this has to be here. This red is amazing. All right. I'm sorry, y'all. I don't do any cinematic shots because it's not really my thing. It takes a lot of time. I'm not really about that right now. If you guys have any questions, leave a comment down below. Once again, shout out to Ogera. And now we're gonna go to the beach because that's what we do right now. We just go to the luxury car dealerships and then go to the beach. <laughs> Peace. Thanks for watching, y'all. Don't forget to like and subscribe.